journey to the NBA. Just tell me a little bit about how you got with the Rockets. Uh, you know, uh, uh, NBA draft this summer. Uh, I was late in the second round. You know, there was a couple teams that were interested in drafting me, and uh, you know, my agent said, "If you don't go drafted, uh, we're probably going to sign with the Rockets." You know, good good guarantee up front, and, and a really good system uh, in play the way I play basketball. So. I decided to go to training camp with them. Uh, it was an uphill battle. You know, you had to make that final 15, and uh, you know when the season started, I made that final 15, and it's been uh, it's been a blast so far. Yeah, you had, you had a good training camp, and you know, I read the quotes from Mike, and he said some really good things about you. So, uh, making what was that like? Knowing that you actually did make the final 15. Oh, it was a great feeling. You know, something I've worked uh, towards my whole life, and now you know it's just about sticking and uh, continuing to get better, even though when you're not getting minutes. You know, just being ready for your opportunity, and uh, you know, hopefully, I'll have a long career in this league. And I just, every every night, every day, I just got to continue to work. Uh, you come into this team; they have a new coach, new system, um, but obviously an established team. What's it like playing with the Rockets, and especially for uh, Mike D'Antoni? Oh, it's awesome! Uh, you know, I'm a really good three-point shooter, and it really utilizes. Uh, you know, obviously threes. Threes are easy twos, is our motto. So you know, for our system, we're up and down. We get a lot of shots up. It's an offensive player's dream, and uh, you know, I think in the in the future, it's going to really, uh, you know, utilize my skill set well. And playing with a guy like Ryan Anderson, who kind of has the same similar skill set as you, what's it like to have him around? Oh, it's awesome. You know, having uh, some good vets in front of me that are teaching me the game. You know, even though I'm not playing, the things that people don't see is we get to practice with these guys every day. You know, guys like Ryan and uh, Big Nene, he's been big and just looking out for me, showing me the ropes and showing me what it takes. So, you know, it's really cool to have a player that I look up to and be able to learn from him. And, and being a rookie, you know, obviously you're going to have a lot of time to learn and watch and watching J a guy like James Harden. I mean, yeah. how much fun is that to see that up front? I mean, it's amazing. He's a tremendous player. Really yeah. <laughs> nice backpack, man. It's awesome. I didn't even plan on getting interviewed. <laughs> Uh, you know, James is an incredible player. He finds the open teammates. He's very unselfish, but he can score with the best of them. Uh, having a guy like that on our team, you know, he's he's what drives us. You know, in practice when we're not doing well, you know, he, he picks us up. So having a leader like that has been really cool too. What, what's life like as a rookie in the NBA? Oh, uh, it's always tough. You know, you're even even on a game day. You know, you're still getting uh, a lot of workouts in stuff like that. After practice, you're staying late. You know, you have to you have to prove your worth and uh, continue to show them that you're working. So you have to do a bunch of work that people don't see. But you know, it's all about uh, getting better. And you know, as a rookie, you just got to continue to learn and uh, you know keep ready because you don't know if someone's going to go down with an injury or or the coach is going to throw you in there. So you have to be ready literally at all times. And if you had that aha moment yet or the oh welcome to the NBA moment yet? Oh, I mean not really you know every single day working out with John Lucas uh, uh, it's uh, it's yeah, I mean I really haven't had that moment yet you know some nights especially being here you know this is probably the biggest moment I've had you know I've worked really hard for this and to be in my own city see my family and then play in the Rose Garden or Moda Center now uh, it's something that I've always dreamed of and you know to finally be here with an NBA team that's probably my big time moment yeah um, just follow up on that you won state championships here you played in the, the hoop summit here yep. what's it like to play here as an NBA player in front of all your friends and family in an NBA oh, game it's amazing you know uh, obviously having those my last memories were positive here winning some state championships and uh, you know for myself to be here with an NBA team uh, on the bench you know uh, it's 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 an incredible feeling. It's it's literally a dream.